Oh, let's push that down very slightly. Hello! Hello. We're making pizza again. We are making pizza, aren't we? Oh, I'll just, just drop the phone. <laughs> right, let's try that again. Oh dear. Right. Okay. What's it doing? What's it doing? Right. So, let's try. And, where are you going now? Oh, okay. Right, we're trying not to drop the phone. Okay. Okay. Up a tiny little bit. Wow, this is a bad start, isn't it? Okay, we ready? Hmm. Okay, so we're going to do pizza, aren't we? So, we've still got a couple of minutes till 11 o'clock, but we're just going to crack on with it. So, I've got my hat on. Have you got your hat on? No. Do you want it? No. Do you want your hat? No. Oh. Fine, no hats. So today, we're going to be making pizza, and we're going to make it really, really easy, really, really simple, with just two things. The first thing that you're going to need is a wrap. We're going to do it on a wrap. We're not going to do any dough, we're not going to do anything like that. We're just going to do it on a wrap. So get a wrap out and bang it into a big frying pan. Two. No, just the one. And pop it into there. Yeah. And then move them to one side. Next thing we're going to do. A yeah. little bit of sauce. Yep, yeah, you can do it. So squidge it in there. We're going to use barbecue sauce. Let's put it upside down. Okay. That'll do. Great. And then we're going to get our spoon. And we're gonna we're gonna spread that around with the back of the spoon, and we're gonna make that all nice and yummy and yummy and yummy. So that's what we're doing now. No more yes. Keep spreading it around. That's good. We get right to the corners. Can I have a little go? Yeah, we're just gonna share it. Spin it all round. Make some noises if you want. Yeah, you do it then. And then we're going to open up our daily lunchable. Now, this is going to be what we're going to be putting on our pizza, okay? So, take off the lid. Once that's all spread around, very good, Lara. All done. Yep, yeah, okay. And if you've got a bit too far to the edges, then just pull it back into the middle a little bit like that. So, move that to the side. Give your spoon a tap and whack that into the wash. Now, we're going to put this lid off. Boom! Like that. We're going to get a little chopping board. Hang on. Yeah, we're going to get a little chopping board. Just tip it all out on the chopping board. Get your biscuits. We don't need our biscuits for this part, so just put them back into there. The cheese is what we're going to do first. So let's leave the ham. We're going to get this cheese. And we're just going to pull them apart. No, don't eat it yet. And just just break it in half, Lara. Yeah. So we're going to make two, two little rectangles out of all these squares. So you break these in half okay. into little rectangles like that, okay? And I'll just pull them off. I'll put them there for you. I'm making tiny. You don't need tiny, tiny pieces, just some medium pieces. Okay, so just break them into... You can do what you want with them, actually. So we're going to get all these little squares. We're going to put those there. Like that. Hey, I got one! Yeah, that's fine. And we're just going to pull all these squares apart from the dairy lunch board. Now, you can get these dairy lunch boards for like a pound at supermarkets they're really cheap at supermarkets they're a little bit more expensive at corner shops but um you can still get them from supermarkets for, for quite cheap wraps are quite quite cheap as well they're really really good so what we're going to do is put all this cheese onto the pizza okay all, all around it yeah? yeah so we're going to put it try and remember that you're going to cut it into triangles so you want a piece on each triangle at least one piece on each triangle so spread them out nice and carefully and get them all around. Cover your pizza like that. Fill up all the gaps that you've got. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Beautiful. That's it. I got, I got the tiny one. Okay. Oh, hey. Fill up all those little gaps that we've got and then we're gonna get our ham. 
<laughs> okay, and now we can just get a piece of ham and just put it, remembering that we're going to cut it into triangles, just put it spread out, okay? So one there, we're going to go one there, one there, one there, one there. I got one. Put one over here, one there, that's it. Yeah, you've already got one there. Okay? Good. Okay. Good. Now. Biscuits. No, we don't need the biscuits. Now, if you've got any more cheese, we've got a little bit more cheese. Let's just pan that back up again. We've got a tiny little bit more cheese. So what we're going to do with this cheese is just put a little bit of sprinkling. I won't do it. Okay, you hold it in that hand then. Mm. And we're just going to just going to put a little bit of a sprinkle over the top. Just literally over the top I of that pan. Yeah, you are doing it. Like that, okay. Now we need to put the frying pan on the heat, okay? So let's just show the, the boys and girls what it looks I like at the moment. Want to so let, yeah, hang on then. So that's what it's like at the moment, okay? So that's got all that dairy lunch one on top of there. So now we need to put it on the fire. So pop it onto there. That's it. Pick it up, pour it over. And you're gonna turn this up, it's hot. Yeah. So you're gonna turn that up, and that's gonna get the bottom crispy before we put it under the hob. And that's where it's gonna go into the hob. If you've got a little bit of olive oil, I'm gonna do, it. I'm gonna do this because it's very, 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 very goes everywhere. Put a little bit of a drizzling on the top. Now if you've got tomatoes, you can put tomatoes in. If you've got plum tomatoes in a can. We've got no tomatoes. If you've got plum tomatoes in a can, you could use the sauce as the base and then you can chop the plum tomatoes up as the topping. Um, so there's lots of ways that you can use all the non-perishable food but with a pizza. So we're gonna get that base, we're gonna get that base crispy, okay? So when the cheese starts to melt in the frying pan, then we're gonna put it under the hob. The hob's on full whack and that's just gonna brown the top of it and get it done. In the meantime, what we can do is have a little biscuit. Yeah. Yeah, can I have one? Yeah. Here you go. Ah. Uh. <laughs> well, this is what we're doing today. Really easy pizza. It's on the hob at the moment. Cheese is starting to melt. It's very, very hot, so we've got to be very careful. So I can see that cheese is now starting to starting to change its shape and start to be a bit, bit more of a liquid. Yeah? And I can hear it. Can you hear it? I can, I can hear it going. Okay. So what we're gonna do now to get ready, we're just gonna make sure that we can still move it by just tapping the outside of it and giving it a little bit of a wiggle. So we can still move that. By it. So we're gonna get that little bit more, little bit more melty. And then we're gonna whack it under the hob. Now that's gonna go under there for about two or three minutes. So in the meantime, what we're gonna do is very quickly wash up what we've got here. Just wash this chopping board up, put that on there to, to dry. Um, that cup, that, no, no, that's been used. That spoon as well. Okay, put that there. Now I'm going to just dry my hands. Okay, I'm going to get this round chopping board because that's what we're going to put the pizza on, and that's going to go onto there. That stops you from touching that because it's still hot, and it gives us a platform to put that on, on to put the pizza onto that's after. Cool. Now. I'm just going to take this out of the oven, and you can see that it's melting very, very nicely. I'm just going to wait for it to get, that's to get... hot. No, that's not hot, no, but underneath is. So we're just going to wait for the pizza to start getting brown now. So it's cooked enough, everything's cooked. The ham's already been cooked because it's in the dairy lunch one, you can eat that cold. The cheese is already done, it's just I melting. So now we're just going to wait for the cheese just to brown a little bit. And then we're going to put it onto here. Thank you, Lara. Or oh, you want to put it in my mouth? Um, wow. Um, I, I don't want it. Right. Turn off the grill. Turn off the grill. That's nicely golden. Yeah, I picked And that's going to go onto here. Hot, hot. 
keep your frying pan out of the way. <sighs> Look at that bad boy. Nicely and golden. Literally minutes. Okay, now this is what I like to do with my pizzas. I like to go in half. And then I'm going to actually fold it in half, like that, while it's still melted. Okay, so now my piece is in half, like this. And then I'm going to chop that down the middle. That my pizza. Do you want yours folded as well? Yeah. Do you want it like that? Yeah. Or do you want it like this? Um, like it. Folded? No, like it like that. So my, mine's folded. Do you want yours folded or do you want it like a normal pizza? Um, normal pizza. Okay, so I'm just going to chop yours like that. And not like... Um, Hang on, fingers. Not um, fold it up, though. You don't want me to fold it up? No. Okay, that's fine then. So, this pizza is still very hot, so we can't have it just yet. So this pizza is barbecue sauce. It's also got the cheese and it's got the ham from the Dairy Lunch Bowl. We've put a little bit more cheese on top and we've put a little drizzle of olive oil on that as well. Um, yeah, I can't, I can't change the name of it because it's actually a company and I'd have to change the name of the company. And um, So I can't change the name of Cooking With, Cooking with Cody. Um, I'm afraid. Because Cody's at school. So this is Lockdown Lunches with Lara. If that makes it any better for you. Yeah, you can try it then. It might be quite hot though. Mmm, yum, yum, yum. And I like that. It's very good. So that's that. That's a nice little pizza in a wrap, very crispy because we've cooked it on both sides. Yeah. And uh, there you go, that's how you do a pizza with, with Lara. Happy days, that's it then. Bye. Bye then.